Hi guys, welcome to the short video about the question which is the most powerful rechargeable portable evaporation cooler some say also air conditioner but of course it's not a real air conditioner it doesn't have a compressor this thing is just uh, pumping the water somehow into this nebulizer here and then spraying it out and it has the fan in the back and then it cools down the room a bit uh, of course it's also producing higher humidity so we need some kind of uh, ventilation or uh, AC running in the background so this can only be a little bit on top and a little bit cooled down in some small areas but again back to the question here which is the most powerful uh, of this type of cooler and I think I have found it now it's called Spornit and it also has a model type you can see that here I think it's called H2106 and if you're interested into that, of course, like always, I'll put down the link of this one uh, down into the description. So anyway, let's do the test here. What I have found uh, that it really consumes a lot of water. It sprays out a lot of water. It has two spray heads. With a lot of such devices, we have only one spray head. What we don't have, we don't have a pump here. It pumps actually the water with some kind of cotton swaps here up and then it goes into these spray heads but it looks like it's working in a very efficient way so it has been running now and it stopped actually i mean i have stopped it and so you can't see that but it has shown the like empty water tank sign and so what i do i fill it up here with exactly half a liter or one bottle of uh, water here that's pretty much 500 milliliters as you can see here i think it's pretty close here uh, 500 milliliters and i start this i start also the stopwatch and then let's see how long it is running unfortunately it doesn't like beep or so when the water is empty so i'll have to check back every couple of minutes but i try to do my very best to find out how long it is really running with the water because also after it stops spraying the water it keeps uh, running the fan in the background so it's a little bit difficult but i think i can do this um, more or less so let's start this here what i do i do it also on the highest level i think there is no difference here between uh, the different levels regarding spraying the th i think the difference is just a fan but to make sure that we do not make any mistakes i go on the highest setting you can see we are on three now I hope it's not interfering with the microphone and you can still hear me I increase the position a little bit of the camera so it's not cr uh, doing crazy sound and I uh, press here the cool button and I uh, activate both of course we start now the stopwatch and we can feel that it's quite uh, cooling down a lot both of the uh, spray heads are spraying now with maximum strength and I keep it running and let's see when it stops and I can show you then the time when it has produced or like sprayed out half of a liter of water and I can tell you it will be a very short time maybe it's half an hour maybe it's an hour but very short with similar devices I have seen much longer run times and maybe one more thing while it's running uh, something for the people who are not watching my channel on a regular base uh, who are w not watching all my videos I can definitely prove you that this thing is reproducing some cool air here when I use this thing here I switch to Fahrenheit I think uh, most of the people are US people who are watching uh, so I can show you the temperature 75 sometimes it's a little bit difficult to measure here maybe even 73 when we go to the side here like on the desk uh, I'll try to hit this point here uh, then we can see the difference here we have 79 or uh, we can see this also on this side uh, 77 78 something like that 78 and then we go back here to this area you can see yeah I had even a 68 for short time it's a little bit difficult to hit the right area but you can see when you hit it the coolest spots 
then it can be pretty low. We have even a 69 here, as you can see. So it's huge difference, and it definitely is very cool air here coming out. I mean, it feels definitely quite coolish. Okay, the nebulizers have stopped. You can see that here. It shows this water sign and we stop this thing here so it's a little bit more quiet and we can open and see that there's definitely not a lot of water here anymore here we have a lot of condensation still there's not much water here and by the way i had stopped it right at the moment when it stopped really almost at the second and it's showing one hour 49 minutes so yeah basically one hour 50 minutes and why did i notice that i mean before it has been spraying i could see that all the time i mean when you look at the side you can easily see the fog coming out there's so much water here and uh, at right at the moment when it stopped the nebulizer uh, the fan started spinning a little bit stronger because I think there is just a certain amount of power here and when it needs less power or like no power uh, for the nebulizers here then it can put more power to the fan which you see here in the back and I could really hear that uh, right at this moment when it stopped so it is definitely uh, one hour 50 it's a little bit longer than what I've been expecting but uh, still it's not very long one hour 50 minutes for such a full bottle of water it's a lot of water which is going into the air i can tell you you definitely need a lot of ventilation in such a room where you want to use that but it definitely also cools down a lot so uh, this is the bar which i have set or which the, this device has set uh, 1 hour 50 for half a liter 500 milliliters if you can beat that then let me know if you are just interested into the device then just click down uh, to the link which i put down into the description of the video you can buy the right from there it's i think it's a good device it's not perfect uh, sometimes it can leak a couple of drops but the main water which uh, is condensating here on this grill is going back flowing back into the tank that's really good we also have this light unfortunately the light only works when the fan is spinning but anyway it's too bright here you can't see that maybe you can see the light it's cycling through all the different colors just a very low night light it's nice but of course i would love it if it would work also without the fan what we also have we can adjust the airflow here a little bit uh, you can see you can turn it like it up a little bit or down a little bit make it more straight i always have it a little bit up so the fog is not uh, going down or the water uh, drops are not going down on the desk and that definitely works really good when i point the airflow a little bit up uh, you cannot adjust it to the side you would have to move the whole device left right and so it doesn't have like any automatic oscillation this is maybe the biggest disadvantage what i see uh, other than that's really good nice display nice functions has this handle we have even two timer settings two hours four hours we have different cooling modes one with the left nozzle one with only the right nozzle one with both nozzle or like uh, just without you can only use the fan as well without any cooling just circulating the air and you can recharge it you can use it with the power that's also a big advantage there are so many devices which you can't use uh, while you are charging them and here you can already use it while you're charging it and then of course you can also use it without the uh, cable just from the charge which is inside which is quite a lot so this is uh, what i wanted to show you again if you have something better than that i mean not a higher time but a lower time for 500 milliliters then let us know down in the feedback area would be really interesting to learn from you if there is a such a small portable rechargeable device which produces even more fog i have tested so many devices and i think none of them is anywhere close to that 
So uh, whatever you have, just let us know. And so I hope I've been able to help you a little bit with this video. If you like it, give me a thumbs up, subscribe my channel. Thanks for watching. See you next time.